So this song is Easily by the Chili Peppers. Um, we've got some chords just to go through to begin with. So pretty basic chords for this. We're going to be using A minor, which is the G string on your second fret. Mine might sound a little bit different, I'm using the low G. Uh, we've got a D minor, which is your first fret, E string. And then second fret for your C and G strings. And then F, all we're doing for F, you should know it, is lift your ring finger off. Those are the basic chords we're going to be using for the verse. Um, for the chorus and the kind of bridge, we're going to be using C, which is just here, G, which is A and C strings on second fret, third fret. E string and then F again. Okay, nice and simple then. It just goes for the verse A minor to D minor to F to A minor. So A minor, D minor. You can kind of play that just as um, up, 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 down, up, up, down, switch. So rather than talk you through it, I'll just show you my hand. So. You can kind of fill that in however you want really it's up to you really how you like to strum that um you want it going quite fast so i quite using my thumb for it that's what i'm doing here uh, also the other thing i do is i chuck in some chunks so doing there is up, strums, down, up, chunk, and then switching onto my D minor, chunk, up, down, up, down, up, so it's kind of like a roll, so it's yeah, um, but yeah, you can work that out however you really want to, so I'm just trying to get my camera in focus, um, so that's kind of like the main, the main strum of it. Uh, let's focus this out a bit more. So that just repeats over. So it just goes. speed that up as well. Um, once you've done that a couple of times, <coughs> listen to the song to know when, uh, you're going to switch to C, then G, then F. So that's C, G, F. And that's the bit that kind of comes in more of a fast delivery, so it just goes. So the bit is telling me exactly what we're fighting for. Uh, so you can play it like that. Which is all down strums. Yeah. You probably want to do it a bit faster, so you can do this quite aggressive, almost a bit staccato-y. So. Yeah, so what I'm doing there, just really fast drums and then when I'm on the G and the F that I'm kind of bouncing on and off with my hands so play it up here so we do this once through So 
once, twice on the A minor for that strum pattern, and then once on the G, once on the F. So all together you should have your verse going. Of it, it just loops over with that a lot of times, um, and that will take you through it all. So, yeah, you, but the weird bit might be you might find just going from A minor to A minor because you go to D minor to F and then to A and then A again, minor that is. Um, cool, so that is the chords, chorus, verses, bridge, all that kind of stuff. Uh, but it's got a really nice picking pattern. So this is quite fun to play. Um, you st I'll play it through and then uh, show you how to do it. So that you can play over if you're playing with someone else, um, or you just play it by yourself. Nice little solo. It's basically just a little rundown. So you start on the tenth fret of the A string, and then you go on the same on the A string. Eight, ten, eight, seven, eight, seven, and then on the E string, eight, seven, ten, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight. Seven, and then you go back to the seventh on the A string, and then the eighth on the E string. So ten, eight, seven, eight, seven, A string, E string, eight, seven, A string, seven, E string, eight. So you play that through twice. So you go. I'm putting a wobble on it sometimes. Uh, put it in if you like it, leave out if you don't. So play it through twice, and then you go up to, I'm in focus, there we go, that's a bit better. Uh, then we go up to 12th on the A string, 10th on the A string, and then 12th on the E string, 10th on the E string, 10th on the A string, 12th on the E string, so M view. So you can kind of break it down to those parts. So 12, 10, 12, 10, 12, 10, 10, 12. You play that through again, so you play it through once, and then you play the same thing again, but instead of ending on the 12th string on the E fret, uh, E string, you end on the 12th fret on the A string, so. First time. So it should sound. Then you go back and play the first bit again. So starting on the 10th. And then you go 7th on the A string. And hit the 8th fret on the A string and slide it straight up to 12th. So it goes. And 
and then you do the same pattern through again for the top part but for the last string instead of the 12th fret you're going to play the 8th fret of the E string which kind of brings it back to the beginning so all together that will go Seasonally by the chili peppers. Cool.